TV formula is hard to come by here in the North Country and across the U.S. Groups trying to help parents say a perfect storm of factors led to these current problems. 7 News reporter Zach Grady has more. There were some supply chain issues um, with ingredients, specific ingredients that was needed. Uh, there was a formula recall in February, um, shipping challenges. So I think it's just a, a perfect storm that unfortunately has reached us here in the North Country. A majority of the baby formula manufactured in the United States is made by just two companies. With one of the two having a recall in February, parents across the North Country have been struggling to find the formula they need to feed their children. They're going to Syracuse, Oswego, St. Lawrence County. Um, they're driving all over the place to find the formula. The shortages have risen to what some are calling a crisis level in several states across the country. Governor Kathy Hochul announced Thursday afternoon the availability of additional resources for families across the state dealing with the shortages. We have a vendor management group that's been working really closely with us. Um, they spend a lot of time on the phone calling the vendors, trying to find it, um, and then directing our families to that um, store specifically. We spoke with Melinda Galt of the Community Action Planning Committee for Jefferson County. She said that they don't have formula on their shelves at the moment is because there is not a need for it. However, if an order was needed to be placed, they're unsure when or where they would be able to get the formula from. Tips that we've been sharing is, again, number one, contacting their health care provider, see what if they have an alternative um, formula idea. Sometimes doctor's offices also have samples. Contacting local food pantries because they have had some supply available as well. Abbott Nutrition, one of the two major manufacturers of baby formula in the U.S., says that it could take up to 10 weeks for them to get their formula stock back to normal. Zach Grady, 7 News.